Women with a Mission, Her Voice, and Mbali Area Federation of Communities, Mafoko Statistics, indicate that girls are more prone to contracting AIDS three times than the boys. The girls, the infections are at 7.5% and for the boys is at 3.5%, meaning that the girls are three times more at risk. You find that in the last one year we have lost 20,000 young people to HIV-related illnesses. But of course out of the 20,000 we have lost, the girls were 15,000 and the boys were 5,000. The HIV AIDS focal person from Mbale district, Wandwas Robert, noted that in Mbale city and the district, 10% of the young people engage in sex before the age of 15 years. About 10% of young, our young people go into sex before the age of 15. And of course this one coupled with the law low information about condom use, then it worries us. In Imbali city, the children that are in a long holiday have been educated on HIV and AIDS. You who are here, keep your lives well. Tell your neighbor, please be careful. This holiday is very long. Ogeda mudisko, tegera tuwari okufa, okale kusabye, obere mulamu, yugande kwetaga, bazande baba kwetaga, nafe tu kwetaga. Some of the girls that attended the advocacy program highlighted the major causes of contracting the disease. Most of the parents, they leave their children to walk long distances where they find sugar daddies, sugar mummies, and these other cheap, cheap people who sell chapati who deceive them. Hence, getting the HIV. Parents, most of you are part of the cause why adolescents are having HIV. Parents, you, you've now moved away from your responsibilities. You no know, a girl needs pads at, at the end of the month, a boy needs something money to keep up him or herself. If you get misunderstandings with the family members, you abandon your your responsibilities. The executive director of women with a mission Uganda, Betty Balisalamu, cautioned the parents to be vigilant onto their children in this long holiday. Uh, we are in the festive season where it's a there is a lot of vulnerability of, and risks of young women and adolescent girls getting HIV. Information is key for us to be able to uh, talk to these young girls, those who are having sex, to have safer sex in terms of having preventive measures 